My friends, it's time for the Salcedo Sound Off. Our producer, Nico Romano, walked around the streets of New York to get people's reactions to the Biden classified document scandal. Watch. Are you guys aware of the Biden document situation? No, you. you don't want to talk about it? No, no. Does it bother you at all that President Biden at one point had illegal classified documents in his possession? It bothers me, but he seems to be more willing to uh, to cooperate than, uh, say, Trump when he did the same thing. Oh, yeah, it's really bad. How does it make you feel? It doesn't feel good. He's a complete moron. Yeah. And so I don't think it was done deliberately because he does it to himself anyway. It doesn't upset me too much. But Trump took like two years and Biden took like two days. Do you think the FBI should raid President Biden's home as well? They need to. What's good for one, good for the other. Absolutely. Hell no. Why not? Because he gave, he gave him the documents. Trump did not give him the documents. He said the second batch of documents that were found were locked in a garage at his home. Is that a safe place for them? No, definitely not. <laughs> the first batch of documents was found in, at, in UPenn, in a Biden think tank which is largely funded by communist China. Is this maybe an example how the Bidens could be compromised by the Chinese Communist Party? Absolutely. The politicians are uh, compromised by China and by Russia as well. I mean, everyone's compromised by politics. But it's all corrupt anyway, mm -hmm. and they're not gonna do anything, right? Because they don't care. And they're gonna sweep it under the rug as much as they can, but they're not gonna be able to. Wow, a myriad response there. Let's